Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm so excited, so excited to be here filming this video. I have heard so many things about this new concealer. I have watched a couple reviews just to see if it was worth me going out and purchasing um, because I know a lot of my followers love the drugstore, love the affordable stuff. So as soon as I heard my girl's Hatsi. Tati and Casey Holmes are my two favorite YouTubers. If they say it's good and they say it's great for oily skin especially, I gotta have it. I gotta have it. So I went out today after watching Tati's video, video and purchased the concealer and it is none other than the e.l.f. 16 hour camo concealer. So um, my Walmart actually had this in stock. I was super shocked super shocked because I forever wanted to be getting my hands onto their um, their like putty primer it's kind of it's like the touch of silk canvas primer and they don't have it so I need to purchase it online and I just haven't anywho they had like three shades of this you guys three um, I purchased two of them it is only wait for it five dollars oh my gosh five dollars and it's supposed to be pretty similar to Tarte Shape Tape. You guys know I love my Tarte Shape Tape. I love a lot of other concealers as well because Tarte Shape Tape can be somewhat drying um, but you guys five dollars like five. I'm shook okay I'm so excited to try this. I did get two shades I got medium peach and medium sand they legit look identical in the tube so we're going to have to do some swatching and see which one suits my skin tone um, and which one we're going to use on our face. Because I am self-tanned, obviously, um, because let's face it, we live in upstate New York. Winter is at its fierce right now. There's so much snow outside. Um, and then we'll have a day like today. Like we got so much snow, icy rain, all of that jazz like for three days. And then now it's like 40 degrees today and the snow is melting, <clears throat> still getting over a cold <laughs> with good reason. Anyway, um, I love the packaging. I feel like it's very luxe for e.l.f. Um, it's super cute. It's just like a little, it's very simple. It's got like the frosted top a little bit and it's just super, super cute. I feel like it's like, I don't know, it just feels luxe you know so um, anyway I have like I said medium peach and medium sand we're gonna try them both Tati ended up using medium peach I think it just has somewhat of a pinkier undertone but legit you guys look at these two concealers can you see a difference <laughs> there's there's like no no difference I don't know if it's picking up on camera but like there's legit no difference in these concealers. It's so crazy. So we're going to swatch them both. Um, it is indeed medium sand and medium huge. I, I was honestly, I wanted to open them in store because I was like, what if they're both the same color? Because they legit look exactly the same. So we're going to swatch uh, medium peach first. And look at the, look at the applicator, you guys. It's like, I, I'm going to get my Tarte Shape Tape. One moment. <clears throat> okay. So here is my Tarte Shape Tape. They look very similar, obviously, aside from the Tarte signature top there um let's see ounceage wise I know the Tarte Shape Deep has 0.33 I believe so the e.l.f. has 0.203 fluid ounces so you definitely get a little less product but $5 to 27 yeah $27 so $5 $27 we're gonna see which one is better okay so um let's get to swatching again this is medium peach I don't know if either of these well we'll see that is promising coverage you guys so that's medium peach I think that one might work medium sand like I said looks exactly the same in the jar this one is medium peach and this one is medium sand um, difference, please? Any difference? I really... 
I guess medium sand has like a teeny weeny, teeny weeny bit darker. I have heard that these oxidize too, so I'm going to kind of wait a few seconds and spread them out and see which one I like better to put on the face. And we're going to try them out. I guess we're just going to go in with medium sand. It's the darker of the two. Like if you look at the boxes, this one is medium sand, this is medium peach. This one is supposed to be darker, so we're going to go in with that one because I am very self-tanned right now. They're like exactly the same. Whoa. 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 Okay. Enough of that. Let's put it on our face. I also like when I can do a one dip into a concealer and get all the areas that I need and I don't have to dip again. I think that's very um, helpful. My daughter texts me. She like never texts me. Okay, I'm letting this sit too long. Let's, let's get to blending it out. Ooh. Don't let it sit, ladies. Um, you guys, Whew. that took some arm, some arm muscle. So don't let it sit for too long. Okay. My arm is like tired from that. Okay, you guys, so final thoughts on this concealer. Um... I'm kind of shook, you guys. So first thing, I did not have to set this concealer. Um, I have not been wearing it for a full day yet, so I think I'm going to include a few more clips of me wearing it throughout the day so you guys can get a better review on this, but I've never not had to set a concealer ever, 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 not even the chart Shave Tape. I didn't have to set it, and there's teeny bit of creasing under my eyes, but for not setting it, I was pretty shook. So I was lazy and I just didn't set it because it was very drying to begin with. So I just, I wanted to give it a go. So here are my thoughts about it without setting it. Um, it has great coverage. I think it blended out decently. I, like I said earlier, left it on too long. So I don't recommend letting it sit. I recommend possibly working one eye at a time um, and blending it out each time. So you're not um, letting it sit on your face too long because it does dry down very quickly. Um, but other than that, I think the shade works out really well. It does oxidize a touch. So I would always shade up, um, in my opinion. But other than that, um, for $5, y'all, go get you some $5 concealer because it is amazing. Um, I won't give super, super amazing thoughts yet because I haven't worn it for a full day. So I will set it to trying it that way and let you guys know. But so far, loving it. Um, and that's it. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys want to see more reviews, definitely let me know in the comments below what you want to see, what products you want me to test out. And um, don't forget to give this uh, video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it while you were watching. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you want to be part of the TCAT family over here on YouTube. And that's it. I will see you guys in my next video. Love you.